Mzanzi, Bakala Baby, two unbelievably gifted young ladies with voices so smooth are set to take the music scene by storm. Cape Town vocalists Andrea Anthony and Zia Phillies are teaming up to make their centre stage debut. And to show you just what they're capable of, take a little listen to this. You're the coffee that I need in the morning. You're my sunshine in the rain when it's pouring. Won't you give yourself to me? Give it all. I just want to see. I just want to see how beautiful you are. You know that I see it. I know you're a star. Where you go, I'll follow. No matter how far. If life is a Oh, just let it keep flowing. Just let it flow. Like a little river above the wow. rock. Absolutely beautiful, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen. Give a feel good welcome to Andy, Soap Star, and Zia Philly. Yeah, baby. Why are you acting all shy now? Uh, you got to know. If you're gonna, if you're gonna post it. We're gonna get it. We're gonna play it to the moon. That's what we do because we love it. We're loving this chemistry and this vibe. I mean, clearly there's a connection there. But musically, what brought you guys together? Andy, what, what birthed this little collaborative um, kind of project? Because you guys were born for each other. <laughs> See, and I have been singing together for a while now. Um, but I think that's very rare that you played that video. That was our audition video to go abroad. Oh, really? So that's how this duo came about. We um, decided to become a duo to travel. That's so, because there, there are opportunities and so many South African performers make their mark on the ships, make their mark overseas, go and hit the casinos and they achieve a huge amount of success and that gives you a wealth base to work from, to create music, yeah. to do these things, which I get, I, I certainly understand that. Mm. How is the creative partnership, Zia? Who drives this? Are you perfectionists? Are you hard on each other? Is there the one who comes up with the hook? How does it work in your creative world? I think I am that one. No shade. <laughs> I think I'm the one that's like more stern. I'm the one with the hand on the wheel. <laughs> Let's say, well, what's, the, what's the saying? The one who wears the pants. In this duo <laughs> Someone has to, man. Someone <laughs> yes. has to. Yes, but she's the one with the most experience. So I, I always, um, if she has something to say, I always listen with both of my ears wholeheartedly and everything. Because, Annie, isn't that the deal here? Yeah. If you are vocalists that are as talented as you, that's the first step. It doesn't guarantee success. It yeah. doesn't mean that you're going to become a superstar, that you're going to hit your mark. Timing, I know, is everything yeah. in your game. I get that. But you've got to keep honing your instrument because that's mm. an instrument you've got to work on. Do you feel like... You, where are you in your mastery of your craft? And what has oh. this experience been like in terms of kind of exciting that creative passion again? I... Um... I am at a, a really good place, actually. I, I've been doing this for some time, so um, and I have a lot of a lot of a lot of um, people look up to me, and um, they. I, I almost want to say, want to be like me, but um, <laughs> no, but you are. You're a mentor, and that's yeah, a beautiful so, thing. Yeah, so um, that that inspires me, and that keeps me going. And I'm, I'm I am, and I, I work extremely hard. So whatever I tackle, I tackle it. 100%, I give 110%. Oh. And um, that's what I, what I try and impart in her life as well. And I got you guys singing in my ear right now and I'm just, I'm drifting away, man. You are so yeah, you guys ridiculously are so gifted. Scalable. I told you, man, if you put it out there, we'll find <laughs> wow. it, man. Now that's Lucian yeah. Albertain, okay? That so. will find you. I, Zia, you've achieved a huge amount for someone so young. Obviously, international singing competitions, one of the biggest kind of on screen. You've been there. One of the backup singers for Belinda Davis. Yeah. Amazing. <laughs> Does this put pressure? Do you put pressure on yourself having achieved so much? And what do you want to achieve? When you kind of sit alone at night and you're thinking about the trajectory of your life, what do you want to I think I really for? do put a lot of pressure on myself because when I see like like my peers and how, um, how well they are doing, I completely forget about how well I did. And I'm like, but I, I, I want to be with you. I want to mm. do what you, you are day. doing. Yeah. <laughs> and then I have to remind myself that what I, I've done some, uh, what, what's the word? Pretty amazing <laughs> things, actually. Yeah. 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 <laughs> so 
I think I should actually stop doing back to myself, you know. Oh, completely. But I think it's, uh, unfortunately, the creative process. Yeah. People who work in your space have to be hard on yourselves because yeah. you're constantly you're judged by the last single you released and you've got to keep it going. Mm -hmm. We are so blessed to have you here <laughs> performing for us and we are going to record it for posterity. So 10 years from now, when you come back, we can play videos and make you feel scarm all over again. <laughs> um, but two unbelievably talented vocalists. I want to say they're here to perform for us, but they're actually here for you. So soak up absolutely every second of this morning's performances.